Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm coming back to you guys with a little bit of the texture cyst. And last time, I got absolutely annihilated by the uh, metal singers, heavy metal band. So let's see, I'm gonna check my notebook real quick. It looks like I'm going to spend the night gathering intel about these black metal vegans. I just need a pair of earplugs, and I'm ready to ha go to Cassia Lane. Right, okay, yeah, that was the oops, that was the fight that I kept losing. So what I'm going to do this time, when I attempt the fight again, I'm going to use these items to make it easy. <laughs> Bible speed. Uh, wait, this makes your score go up. But I don't want the Bible to move faster. Speed up, oh, sure, let's take that. I thought I'd have more useful stuff. Okay, whatever, we can move, we can move faster now. I don't know if it's noticeable on this screen. Anyway, let's just get right to it. I'm ready to go beat that boss this time. The outer circle. Here we go. Shadows waving on our tofu. The ritual of northern shiitake. Your soy will be corrupted, burning your soul like a barbecue. Everyone's too distracted by those people. I need to think of something or I'll never make it through this human barricade. Yeah, if I remember correctly, I just talk to everyone. And, um... I'm just gonna skip through this because I know I've already done it once. Anyway... Pretty sure I just talk to people until yeah, let me kick this. Oh yeah, I think I know how to operate this guy. <laughs> All right, just uh, I'm just gonna skip through this. Get straight to the fight. If you want to see the dialogue, then uh, just watch the last video. It was in there. Here we go. We're not gonna lose this time. We're gonna we're gonna win it this one. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna skip through here. Let's just get the fight started. Already. Yeah. There we go. Okay, now this should be the fight. This is where things get real. We won't let you escape from this place. Taste the powers of my helm. lost one health, but I think I can make it work. I swear. Oh, shit, I messed up already. That's 
half. Bars left. Oh. One heart left on him. We've got two left. This is I'm doing a lot better than I did last time, that's for sure. You little nuisance. You already know you've lost everything, yet you keep fighting, and for what? You can't take back what isn't yours anymore, Ray. Now perish. Oh. It means I win. Ooh, that felt that feels really good after losing three times. All right, we beat him. We beat the the rock god. Whoa, man! What did you do to me? I could ask the same. Were you aware of being possessed? What possessed? No way. I just imagine him as like a surfer dude. So yeah. So all these rumors about you guys being demons? It's just our music, man. We're just normal vegan guys who want to have some fun. We wouldn't hurt a fly. We respect animals and nature. Oh, did I already tell you we're vegan? I've got nothing to do here. I'd better be going. Wait, you freed me from that thing after all. I want to help. All right, it's worth a try. Wait, what's he going to help me with? Oh, have you seen the girl in this picture? Who, the cute one? No, that's Magda, my assistant. And she isn't cute, just annoying. Okay. I'm referring to the other girl. Oh, the wild one. Sure, she was with our groupies. We hired her a couple of weeks ago. Hired. Wink wink. Groupies. Is this what you call young slaves? You horrid. What? Slaves? We respect women. We'd never do that. It's just that we get lonely. You know, vegan black metalheads aren't exactly chick magnets. But we never laid a finger on them. Where is she now? She had a bit of a temper so when some people from the holy church came and offered to take care of her we decided it would be better for everyone 
What? The Holy Church? That's ridiculous. Wait, are you sure they were from the Holy Church? Of course, I could tell from their clothes. At first, we complained that taking away our groupies would have been disastrous for our lives, but they gave me that helm in exchange. People from the church shouldn't be handing over possessed armor to random musicians. Obviously. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he, he said that as if he he need it needed to be said. But I guess I mean it happened. Anyway. Hey kid, listen carefully and try not try to focus. Do you remember where those people were taking the girl? Any clue would be useful. Oh god, I think it was some kind of wait, they were from a convent with a saint's name. It started with a T. This could be bigger than I thought. I hope this all is a misunderstanding. We unlocked the thick pages. And we made it to the next level, I guess. Or we we will begin at the next level. Thursday, some some date. Okay. Let's see what Magda is doing. Morning, Ray. So how was the show? Did they play your favorite song? <laughs> no, they didn't. But they tried to kill me instead. So wait, they were demons after all. No, they weren't. Actually, yes, but only their leader, and. Well, that's confusing. This is all getting out of hand. I I have a reason to think the Holy Church might be behind all of this. Do you realize how serious this is? Yes. I mean, the Church has always ruled pretty poorly. They're not new to shady activities, either. I have reason to think they're supporting the diffusion of demonic influence. And this goes far beyond some simple crime. Hey, by the way, did you find my friend, the girl with me in the picture? No, no I didn't. But I might be very close to tracking her down. I hope she's not hurt. Yeah. I really hope that too. I don't know if that's sarcasm or not, but I, I don't... I guess since he said to himself, it probably isn't. You look worried, Ray. I better be starting my investigations to find the place where your friend could be right now. Is there any way I can help you? Unless you remember all the sacred buildings and structures under the Holy Church domain. No, you can't. I don't think anybody does. That's why they have a list on... List on on the Vatnet. Seriously? Of course. You just look for the Holy Church on your computer. Everything's on the Vatnet these days. However, if Magda is speaking the truth, that piece of junk Holy Vetti is going to come in handy once again. Okay. Uh, okay, so what? Should I just, like, should I put in VATNET? Or just go to the Godel thing? And then type in Holy Church? It's probably, it's probably pretty simple. Overthinking it. Uh, maybe not. Okay, I'm gonna put in VATNET then. No. Um. Uh, let me just try Holy Church again. Okay, wait, yeah, see, was that there before? Did I misspell it before? Anyway. There's a list of buildings, oh no. Am I gonna have to go to all of them and, like, figure it out? I hope not. It's a list of their buildings, right? Oh wait, there's more than one. It starts with a T, right? Yeah. Saint, this convent of Saint Tarantinus, Saint Tarantinus. It looks like the only result that matches the info the blonde guy gave me, but there's only a phone number. Do I have a phone? Um, I got to remember the phone number. Hold on. 0652391890. Now, you know, I don't think I'm going to be able to remember that. 
wonder if simply calling that place is going to get me anywhere. Well, here goes nothing. Yeah, I didn't have to remember the fucking number. <laughs> oh well. Good morning, this is Convent of St. Tarantinas. Yeah, I was interested in your latest 3 for 2 special on indulgencies, and all of our operators are busy at the moment. Please call back or come and find us on Pr Prinestina Boulevard. Click. Okay, it was automated message. That was easier than I thought. Good job, Ray. Next stop. Presentina Boulevard. Why did it... Why is the red text like that? I don't know if that's like a... Like, bug or some what. I don't know. Peristina Place. Let's go. I want to read my journal, though. I want to see what it has to say. I got their address on the phone, and I didn't even need to talk to anybody. How cool is that? Next stop, the convent of St. Ter... Terentius, I guess, on Pranestina Pr Boulevard. These fucking hard to pronounce names. Here we go. Pranestina Boulevard. Oh. Meanwhile, somewhere inside the Vatican's walls... Furious! Take some of your men and go pick up the girl. Be quick! Why the hurry? The hard part was finding her. Now that she's at the convent, we could go pick her up whenever we want. Can't you relax a little? Remember what the doctor said about overdoing it? I think someone else could be tracking, right tracking her right now. An old acquaintance of the Holy Church. And we don't know how fast he's moving. A former priest. An exorcist. He left almost 20 years ago. Whoa. An exorcist. This is gonna be fun. I was starting to get bored of practicing my new powers on my shoulders. On my soldiers. And too many of them were starting to get dead. Be sure to prepare, prepare thoroughly. I don't want the exorcist to make the girls slip out from under their noses. What? What? I mean, what's with the nose thing? The only thing I see under your nose is your... Mm. You crooked sociopath. It was a metaphor. I already explained how it works a thousand times. Oh jeez, I didn't... Oh jeez, did I do that again? Seriously, listen, can't we agree on a signal? I don't know, a hand gesture or maybe some flash signal. It's also pretty dark in here, and we could totally use a torch. Out of my office now! Next time I want to see your face is when you'll bring me the girl! Leave it once! Yeah. You enjoy my little voice acting there? I try. I'm not a great voice actor, but I'll do it for you guys. Nice place they have over here. Perhaps my decision to leave the church was made in haste. What? A priest? Now? Why? Ahem. Welcome to our convent, Los Soul. What can I do for you? Come, come over here. Oh, do they train people to sound fishy from the very moment they start talking? <laughs> can I sit? Is there anything I can attract with? None. Oh, a member of our order. What a nice surprise. I don't even remember the voice I gave her a second ago. Hmm, excuse me. Yes, no, I'm not exactly a member of your order. You definitely don't look like one of our sisters. Ho 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 ho. No, I mean, I'm a private exorcist. Oh, well, that's interesting. What can I do for you? 
I'm tracking down a demonic outbreak involving some girls that may have passed by your convent. What do you exactly do here? <coughs> oh, sorry about that. I have to clear my throat. Uh, I'm really sorry to hear that. We at the St. Ter Terentius Convent offer shelter and a number of useful activities to all the poor young girls that have no parents or family. Right. You help them. Nothing bizarre has happened to them lately. No strange events. No episodes of possession. Uh, absolutely. No strange events. No episodes of possession. No sacrificial blood. Uh... Damn it. Could I talk to some of your girls? Damn, she gave away the sacrificial blood. She was this close. She's so close. I really am afraid that isn't possible right now. They're out of the convent doing their chores. What? All of them? Y yes Incredibly devoted girls they are indeed. Would you mind if I took a look around? No, no, please. Do as you do as if you were at your own convent. Uh, if reinforcements don't come in quick, I'm screwed. I feel like I'm giving her the same voice as the other, like, the boss guy, but... Okay, well, look, I'm sorry, I, like, spaced out on what I'm supposed to do now. I'm probably gonna end up fighting her. Is she gonna be a demon? Should I talk to her again? Oh! This doesn't exactly look like any of the other toilet doors I've come across in my lifetime. There's a skeleton in there! What do you mean, toilet door? That's a freaking skeleton! That's a- someone's dead! That's a dead person! Can I open the other door now? Or should I, like, confront her about the skeleton? Is there anything else you want to discuss with me? Cellar door. Okay. I was looking for the toilet, but instead I found a cell packed with human bones. Care to explain? Oh, that? That's where we keep the bones for our dogs. Dogs? Yes, guard dogs. To protect our girls, of course. And no trace of those dogs, either. They're with the girls, obviously, protecting them during their errands. Is there anything else you want to discuss with me? Nope. Don't leave the room, I'm not done yet. So go ahead, there's more clues in here. Oh, sorry, I thought I got something stuck in my throat today. I could possibly interact with except for the other doors or hmm. yeah, definitely can't interact with that and I don't think it lets me interact with this door Side? No. Oh, wait. Okay, here we go. Oh, secret door. Oh, it's a blood chalice. Blood fountain. I couldn't make some silly tomato sauce joke, but this stuff really looks like blood. I think I'm going to be sick. Okay, we gotta confront her about the blood chalice. It's not really not cool to have a blood chalice in your convent. 
Just saying. <laughs> Is there anything else you want to discuss with me? Uh, yeah, the sacrificial blood. Listen, I've just noticed that your holy water has got something wrong with it. Uh, like what? Like, it really looks like sacrificial blood. Oh, that? That's not blood. That's red wine. Don't you know the tale of Jesus, the guy who turned his blood into wine to give booze to his disciples? That sounds... biblical? Yeah, maybe it's just biblical. Is there anything else you want to discuss with me? Oh, are you telling me there's another... another one? Nope, but don't leave the room, I'm not done yet. Uh... I don't remember the things she said. I remember she mentioned the... Like, no sacrificial blood fountain. And then we found the sacrificial blood fountain. So... Possibly get a clue from. I'm checking all of the pews because. What the hell? Maybe you win. Wait. Like this, maybe? No. It's not one of the bookshelves. I feel like all these random bookshelves, one of them would have a clue behind them, but no. No such luck. And that door doesn't do anything. Is it one of the statues? Is one of the statues doing something weird? I just brushed up against one of the books, and this happens? Splendid. She's got a weapon rack and a bookshelf. Okay. We're gonna have to confront her about this weapon rack. Is there anything else you want to discuss with me? Uh, yeah, the library weapons. Are you aware that there's some medieval weaponry hidden in your libraries? Oh, that? Of course. We teach our girls that culture is their best weapon. Uh, that is literal. Well, is that all? Looks like I have no concrete evidence to link these people to the outbreak or even to the girl. Yeah, for now. Well, it was a pleasure. The door's over there. Have a nice day. May God be with you, etc. Phone's ringing. Good day, Convent of St. Terentius. What can I... Oh, it's you. Uh... Uh, sure. The hummingbird is ready to drink the nectar. Be quick. Uh, I mean, that you should take the tiger by the toe and get your men here fast. Oh, god damn it! you still haven't learned how metaphors work? You senseless fool. Get your armored ass over here immediately, otherwise we'll lose the girl. I knew it! No, you didn't. I almost fooled your bald ass. Too bad for you, Ray. Not only are you a meddling halfwit, you're a persistent meddling halfwit. I probably won't even need any reinforcements. Oh, oh, oh. oh shoot. Okay. None fight. Um. Okay. Before I go any farther, I hate to do this to you, but I am going to stop the video here. And, um, but I am gonna fight the boss right after this, and then that video will be up shortly after this one gets posted. So you, hopefully it won't take too long for you to check out this fight. But anyway, I'm gonna stop it right here. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.